Hi there guys, I'm going to introduce um, a new axle that we're working on, which is this one here. Um, but first of all we'll start off with this. This is what most of you will know as a, a WPL or JJRC or Helifar style axle. It's got a 3mm shaft and crown wheel pinion. Um, and what we've done is we've just made a modular um, axle which is made up of several different parts. So here's one that We've just glued together. It consists of a center of the diff, which has got mounting holes so that you can just use the standard um, input shaft and diff cover. And then we've got different length axle tubes. So if we just look at this here, in here, that locates in there, that would then be glued and then you can now mock up your axle. Obviously that one's not the right one there, but um, you know, you can move the the mount further in or further out, however you want. Obviously you have different length axles. This is one we've made now, and there's another one. The good thing about this is you can either use the plastic internals and then just cut the, the metal shaft down to put these ends on, or you can use the metal kits as well. But here we are. It fully works. It's going out of focus. Whoops. What we do is we just fit some wheels that we 3D printed. There we are. There's our axle. So it's quite an arrow axle there. But if you just give me one second, I will then show you another one. If we take this out of the way, here's another model that I'm building at the moment. It's a 116 scale Kuba wagon. And if we just take this all out of here, here is another axle we've been building. This time it's got little four link brackets. So we've got damper mount at the back and then these are the four link brackets. So we then go into the cross pattern for where those mounted to the car so that it obviously locates the axle. There's another axle that we're working on for this Kuba wagon. Cool, that's it for now.